Good morning, boys and girls, and happy Friday. Look at this hair of mine. It is crazy. All right, it's Friday. Put everything away. You need nada, nothing, not even your fairies. So blow those fairies away. All right, are we ready to go? Let me just make sure I got all my stuff together. All right. Now, listen, the words this week are kind of tricky, but I'm going to give you a little hint. It's the shun. So do the, uh, the words end with T-I-O-N or S-I-O-N or chur? Who knows? All right, here we go. Number one, quotation. Quotation. When you're writing a narrative story, you need quotation marks. Quotation. Number two, immature. Immature. My 18-year-old is still so immature. Immature. Number two. Number three, division. Division. Do you know all your division facts? Division. Number four, puncture. Puncture. The rose bush punct put a puncture in my leg. Puncture. Number five, nation. Nation. The United States is a united nation nation number six confusion confusion the erratic behavior of the child caused much confusion during the zoom class confusion Number seven, action, action. The superhero stepped into action as he saved the girl from drowning. Action. Number eight, vision, vision. This weekend, I vision myself on a baseball field, vision. Number nine, structure, structure. The Jenga structure was not sturdy enough and so it fell, structure. Number 10, position, position. My son plays sec the second base position for baseball. Position. Number 11, departure. Departure. Mm, I'm trying to think of a word, a sentence with departure. Departure means to take off. Departure. Number 12, revision. Revision. The boy did not do well on his first paragraph, but his second revision was flawless. Revision. Number 13, confession. Confession. My one confession is that my fairy helps me daily. Confession. Number 14, attention, attention. Do you pay attention to your teacher's words? Attention. Number 15, version, version. Most of the times I like the book version rather than the movie version, version. Number 16, vulture, vulture. Sometimes in my neighborhood, 
I will see a turkey vulture perched on a lamppost. Vulture. It's so cool. Vulture. Number 17. Combination. Combination. I like a combination of Skittles and Sour Patch Kids as a snack near my desk. Combination. Number 18, capture, capture. The, s the secretary bird quickly, ooh, I was gonna say captured, capture. The snake, oh, I still wanna say captured, but actually the word is capture, capture. Every sentence I wanna say it with an ed in the, pa in the past tense, but it's not captured, it's capture. So please make sure you write that, capture. Number 19, permission, permission. I did not have my parents' permission to turn off my camera, permission. Make sure you get your parents' permission to turn off your, your um, camera because us teachers, when we're looking at the screens, we wanna see all of your faces so we can see you working, but when your screen is black, we have no idea what you're doing. So please make sure that you get your parents' permission. And number 20, question, question. I love when my students type a question in the chat, question. Okay, for all those newcomers, cause we have some new students, um, throughout the classes, I'm going to say it again. Um, please make sure that you don't put anything on capital letters because none of these words um, are pr proper nouns. They're all common nouns. All right. Number one, quotation. Number two, immature. Number three, division. Number four, puncture. Number five, nation. Number six, confusion. Number seven, Action, number eight, vision, number nine, structure, number 10, position, number 11, departure, number 12, revision, number 13, confession, number 14, attention, number 15, version, number 16, vulture, number 17, Combination, number 18, capture, number 19, permission, and number 20, question. All right, hope you will, you did very well. Make it a great day. Happy Friday.